let's think about where we would plot 2 sixths on this number line. So let's count what each of these little marks represent. So we have, when we're going between 0 and 1, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 of these marks. Or another way to think of it is these marks split zero, the, the length of our number line between 0 and 1 into exactly 6 equal spaces. So this is 1 of the 6. Then this is another of the 6, so that gets us to 2, 6. If we go another one, we get to 3, 6. We go another one, we get to 4, 6. Then 5, 6. Then this is 6, 6, which is the same thing as 1. So to answer our question, where is 2, 6? Well, this gets us to 1, 6. Then another 6 gets us to 2, 6. If someone were to ask you, where is 5, 6? Well, that is 1, 6, 2, 6, 3, 6, 4, 6, and 5, 6. If someone were to ask you, where is 3 over 6? Well, once again, this, these, and you have to make sure this is splitting up the number line to exactly six equal spaces between 0 and 1. But if you do, then these are each sixths. And so you get 1, 6, 2, 6, and 3, 6. And you may or may not know 3, 6 is the same thing as 1 half. If you divide 3 by 3, and 6 by 3, you're dividing by you're dividing the numerator and the denominator by the same thing. You get 1 half. And that makes sense, because this is exactly 1 half of the way between 0 and 1.